Tyler won uh, the best Afrobeats uh, song okay. for mm-hmm. Water. She was there? She yeah. was yes. there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there's a whole fucking shit going on what? online about her asking um, uh, Hallie oh. to hold her award while she gave her acceptance speech. People just making a mountain out of a fucking molehill. A mountain? No. I, no, I don't think so. I don't think they made a mountain out of a molehill at all. So, why? I want to find uh, Armand Wiggins' tweet because he said it a lot nicer than I'm going to say it. Actually, fuck it. Somebody else find it, the tweet while I fucking uh, do this. She's annoying that girl. What? <sighs> Go ahead. She seems, seems, again, she's a young woman. I love her debut album. I'm not talking about musically. Mm-hmm. I'm talking about when she shows up in support of the music. Mm-hmm. She comes off like a dick. This is Armand Wiggins' tweet right here, Spiritual World. My girl, Big Mel. Mm-hmm. Hold me down. Uh, Armand Wiggins says, hey, I don't think I like Tyler's personality. I think someone needs to check her because she doesn't understand American culture at all. I could not agree more with this. She almost gives off entitled or uppity African. I don't know how to explain it, but it's very off-putting, and it's almost like she expects people to just fall to her feet. That is Armand Wiggins, who I fuck with a lot. Shout out to him. Uh, if you don't know him, Google him yourself. But I felt like this before the VMAs, by the way. Because she popped up at the Barclays in support of Usher. Mm-hmm. Yes. I saw that. Oh, that's and when Usher and when Usher attempted to do his showmanship dance while her record is playing, come on, let me, we in front of 20,000 people. She, she spun Let's him get around. in our bag. She, she spun dubbed him. him. She did. Mm-hmm. The, okay. They say that they say there's a reason for it. I don't give a fuck yeah. what the reason is. The reason ah, is that nah, she's nah, got nah, a man. Nah, nah, nah. I, I don't she, give a fuck about your man. Okay, so Yo, you the reason I'm not is, out of line. You on line, this stage. You, I should got a girl. Okay. So what, True. nigga? Well, everybody maybe, parameters is different. Yeah. Yeah. And he was coming oh, up behind yeah. her, hey, trying yo, to whine hey, yo, on her. Y'all preach your ideals somewhere else. We you in say, front of 20,000 people right so now. So you saying somebody so should go your to Your album came out. I'm telling you what I'm saying. Don't step on what I'm saying. I'm telling you what I'm saying. That sounds dumb. I'm telling you what I'm saying. Your album came out ages ago. There's mad money being spent on putting you where you need to be to be seen properly. Usher Raymond does not have to bring your little new artist ass on stage. He don't. She was in the crowd. She was in the crowd. She I don't stage. give that, a fuck where she was. That tell, that sh- tell that shit to your group chat. Once you hit the stage and you are a performer and your song is on and a legend is trying to highlight you, there is a way to do that do do shit that she did. did. She did it oh, in a way wait, wait. that looked real oh, nasty. And I thought this before the VMAs. Didn't we violate Joe. Kiki Palmer for playing into that nigga? Joe. Hold, on. Hold on, Joe. That, she was in the crowd. She never he bought her on stage. Crowd and tried to she dance never bought her, her, her on crowd. stage. She was not on stage. Yeah. He came to her. He went to her and tried to dance with her in the crowd. I hate talking music with non-music people. Ice, right, so you think that was by chance? You think that was an accident? No, he spotted her in the crowd and went no. to her in the crowd. Or, or, oh, so, you, oh, so you think that was coincidence? No. His no, they knew told they, him. Yeah, they she told was him. in the crowd. Do you think that, just that like was with Mel, good. Just like Lucky Day with Mel. Exactly. So do you think there. that was a surprise to Tyler is my question? That Usher was going to come over there and dance with her? No. She so why the fuck you telling me where she was at? Because listen, you're saying you listen, brought her on stage this, to dance. Great. I don't do care that. where she was at. The show was going on, and she dubbed him in a way that looked like, oh. This it, was, a, it was out dance, but not that. Respectfully, no, back no, up. No, it gave back don't up. touch me nigga is well, what it wait, gave. So up. hold on, wait. I it, got a nigga, and he might. It gave don't touch me nigga. It gave, wait, it gave, wait, it gave wait, respect my boundaries, my nigga. That's what it gave. Some have, women do that. We have nigga, a, he wasn't gyrating on the little girl's ass. He, got he, up. Up. he, he went, tried to get behind her, yo. Yes, he did. Yes. You're, you're wrong. He tried to get behind he tried her, to dance she closer. and backed off. He, like, he tried to and dance closer. And y'all eviscerated this, Kiki Palmer not for that. the same yeah. shit, no, having a man moved, and yeah, dancing up she on moved, him. I love to see passion from you guys. She moved long before there was <laughs> I any... Love I love no. This passion looks great. Uh, no, awesome. It's beautiful on y'all. She moved yeah, long passionate. before there was a pelvic thrusting from Usher. And right after I finished talking about Tyler, we can get in there if Usher's a creep or not. Fam, I'm not mad. Hey, hey, wait, wait, wait. Hold up. That's fun to me. Okay. I think these R and B niggas is creeps. I think and they do. You making I'm not gumbo? To, I'm not trying to invalidate what you're y'all saying. You're making gumbo, bro. No, 
I'm talking. I'm not trying to invalidate what they're saying. Sure. The R&B niggas be on some shit with girls that got a man and be doing shit on the stage and, and trying to pass it off as showmanship. Okay. They do, and maybe Usher was trying to do that. Okay. I'm saying, before the VMAs, the way that she did that came off away. This Armand Wiggins tweet is saying she just seems tone deaf to American culture. That Armand Wiggins tweet sounds like some bullshit to me. Man, and, and he said, "I don't know this girl, but I don't like how she acts." What? Right, <laughs> fam. Yo, dog. But but she. But every time you see applicant. her visibly, there is something like this. There was the Breakfast Club interview where it's like, uh, okay, got it. There's this Usher shit. There's this when she accepted the award. Yeah, girl, stop it now. Stop. You don't know that you getting up there to accept the award. Listen, I didn't even like how she fucking put her hand on the person that was walking her to the stage. I hated that. That's crazy. Man. I don't give a fuck what you talking about. I'm telling you how I felt. There's a well, way you to... don't like the girl, Joe. No, yeah. there's a no. Let's come across like the girl, Joe. No, yeah. please. So just because you... y'all don't agree, don't don't fucking invalidate what I'm saying and let me say what I'm saying you because said, I thought said. long and hard about what I'm saying. I've seen Taylor Swift and everybody else that get walked up there do that same move away. They all got to get walked up there. I'm not highlighting her, but if you got a long dress on, somebody's walking you to the stage. There is a way to depart from that person. I'm telling you that when Tyler did that, it could look a way. Let's continue it. She don't know that saying this award is too heavy and trying. Hey, can you hey, carry hold this? I'm not saying that she wasn't genuine in what she was saying. I'm saying it comes off a way. Niggas are not off base for highlighting that. It came off a way. And Chloe looked at her like, I mean, not, um, Holly. Holly. not Chloe. Holly looked at her like, girl, <laughs> yeah, Lil Nas X, you better. You didn't watch it. I saw that. That clip is I'm going viral. People that, that clip, clip is viral. I don't viral. give a fuck about everywhere. a clip going viral. I'm talking about sitting there through commercial break and seeing it and feeling it in the moment. Fuck that clip. How would you have held it? No. So what the? F well, but there's maybe a man I there, and he grabbed it. As you should. O also, let me say, Lil Nas X is fucking maturing like the kids from Stranger Things. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they got a new. They part. pussy core. <laughs> they pussy. That's what. Well, and they ain't see it. So let me not call him pussy. But they ain't see it. Lil Nas X is growing up. Fast. I don't know if it's still cute anymore. <laughs> oh, man. Hey. I, yeah, I ain't see that. Yeah, but I will go back, going back to Shorty, though. That girl comes she off could, away. She could also have... She comes off entitled and nah, privileged. She, yeah, I, I she comes off away. I, I, see, I see something different. I see them trying to keep her clean and mess-free. So she could have a team around her like, yo, we don't want you tied up with no niggas. No, we, again, we saw what happened with Kiki Palmer. So exactly. if she get the dancing with him. Fried up. Now that clip is going mm -hmm. everywhere. We're trying to keep this girl cookie cutter clean. We don't want none of that type of shit. We just want to keep you clean. Not just that. We seen what happened with Mary J. Blige when Usher got up there and was trying to, and Mary kept hitting that nigga with the mm -hmm. Heisman shit. We ain't say nothing. Nope. Not a fucking word. Mary's word. hitting that nigga like, stop playing, dog. Stop playing again, nigga. I no. had enough of her. I need a new slap before I continue <laughs> to support this off-putting <laughs> shit. You ain't going to water me to death. Oh, Sorry. <laughs>no, that's when she told the whole award. I'm trying to find her uh, speech. Here we go. You guys know me and holding awards. You, I am not. I'm not strong enough. Yes, please. Are you able to offer me? Yes, thank you. I'm sorry. Thank you Girl. so much. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Firstly, thank you. Thank you, my tigers. Thank you. Yeah, I, I'm with you, Eve. TV, my team, God, everyone. This is such a big moment for Africa, African music. Like, <laughs> The global impact that water has had on the world just proves that African music can be pop music too. Oh, I see. Y'all don't hear, hold up. Like, but you're going back to the Africans shut looking down. Shut the fuck up. Uh, wait, you're going back to the Africans looking down on Americans. Is that, is that, the, is that the audience? Is that where you're coming from with this? I'm, I'm not going to do that. Okay, that's what I'm saying. That's I'm only, not going to do that. That's why I hear you going with it. But. I'm it, telling you, for the people that believe that she's a little off-putting, it's not from osmosis. Okay. But I, okay. We I didn't see. need the impact of water to let us know that 
fucking uh, Afrobeats music can be mainstream music, especially if you've been around and listening for the last three to four years. Have we had an Afrobeats record do what Waters doing? I don't know. That's not my genre. Yeah. I'm asking y'all a question. I don't, yeah. I've heard I, I, this which record one? everywhere. Which, I ain't, which really? one? What's an Afrobeats record and dun, 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 an dun, dun, dun. record that's done with this? Dun, dun, dun. Is doing? Dun, 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 this shit right here. Yeah, what are y'all? Whiz, Whiz, I'm, I'm literally is, just asking is a question Beats. as a person that's not a fan of Afrobeats. So I'm, mm-hmm. I'm just having a conversation. And, and my, I didn't get that from that, but we don't know how long it has taken for them to bridge that gap. Like these niggas could have been trying for the last 15 years mm-hmm. to get that music to go mainstream. I'm telling you that this girl was nominated with the Afrobeat greats. Mm-hmm. She's at, she's nominated with DeVito. She's nominated with WizKid. Mm-hmm. She's nominated with Burner Boy. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. Shit, I think Drake might have been nominated. Uh, somebody was nominated. I was like, oh, shit. But she's nominated with the people that do that them, in that in them. that bag, and she won it. Mm-hmm. Cool. Not taking that from her. Shout out to her. But how you normally sound as a new act that wins an award from the people that have dominated this genre, it normally sounds a little different from. More this. appreciative? It, no- it normally sounds Humble. different than, hey, the impact of water lets y'all know that Afrobeats is mainstream. What? New Joe Biden.